Hey, everybody, and thank you for tuning in. Um, Audrey, storytelling time. I am going to read a book today about the Rugrats. Yes, I have a Rugrats book. Everybody likes the Rugrats. Um, it's a Rugrats book, Nickelodeon. Um, it's by Jill Gorey and Barbara Herndon. I'm trying to get this straight. Okay. It's called Mine. It's a grown-up's guide to life uh, with little ones. Help some of these parents out. So the introduction reads, Tommy, I want you to meet someone very special. This is your brother, Dylan. Dill, this is Tommy. So she introduced them. She introduced him to his new baby brother. I know some of you have experienced um, having another little one in your, in your um, family, another little one being born. Okay, so Angelica says, poor Tommy got a new baby brother. Chucky said, what's wrong with having a baby brother, Angelica? Angelica said, nothing, except he's gonna have to start sharing everything, his clothes, his toys, his mommy and his daddy. Pretty soon, that drooly baby's gonna take everything Tommy has. See what I mean? Look at that, look at the pictures. Who says he'll, even want my stuff anyway. He says, mine, mine, mine. Sharing daddy. Daddy's real good at sharing. He shares his shoulders with me. He shares his arms with Dill. And his feet with the lawnmower. Sharing Spike, uh-oh, I miss Spike. I wonder why he's spending all his time with Dill. Sharing Mommy, my mommy rocks me and cuddles me. She rocks and cuddles Dill too. She sings to me, she sings to Dill too. She loves us both and calls us both son. But I'm the only one she calls Tommy. Sharing the kids, Dee Dee. Dee Dee is saying, we'll give four pictures to my parents and two of the big ones to pop. Oh, and let's not forget Charlotte and Drew. Chucky says, what are your mommy and daddy doing, Tommy? Tommy says, sharing us with the rest of the family. Sharing Tommy, don't forget to save some water for me. What does he want from me? Looks like he wants everything, Tommy. Stu says, he's got your eyes, Deed. His old man's chin pops ears. Chucky says, I don't think it's safe to let him grab your ears no more, Tommy. Gee, Tommy. I know we're supposed to share with Dill, but this is ridiculous. He's trying to suck on his thumb. Okay, Dill, I shared my favorite blanket with you. Now, can I please have it back? Ah, uh, that's okay, you can keep it. Tommy says, Dill's having trouble eating. Chucky says, that's because he don't got no teeth. Tommy says, I'm sure my grandpa won't mind sharing his. And he's running up with, with grandpa's teeth. That's so funny. Trying to help. I can swear Tommy said, I like dictionaries. I don't want to brag, but I really think they're advanced for their ages. Take after their old man. Dill always gets a big smile when he sees his daddy. There go mommy and daddy sharing the phone again. Sharing a joke. Susie. Susie says, 
What do you call a giant with carrots in his ears? Baby say, I don't know. What, Susie? Susie says, anything you want, because he can't hear you. A poem about sharing with Dill by Susie Carmichael. Roses are red, violets are bluey. If you share stuff with Dill, it's gonna get gooey. Sharing memories. Lou, I remember the time I wrestled a grizzly, one hand tied behind my back. Tommy says, Grandpa loves to share his memories. Chucky says, are memories as good as raspberries and blueberries? Tommy says, I don't know, Chucky. Mommy says they're kind of sweet, but Daddy thinks they are hard to swallow. Where is he going to sleep? Chucky says, He's got your old bed. Tommy says he'll probably need this too. Sharing in the kitchen. I like sharing when mommy gives me smushed peas. Betty says, I installed pup proof locks on all my cupboards and drawers, Dee. Dee Dee says, me too. Better to be safe than sorry. Lil says, hey, these doors are locked. Tommy says, I think that's what our mommies do when they don't want to share. Sharing bedrooms. Dee Dee says, I just hope we're doing the right thing having the boys share a bedroom. Minka says, you worry too much, did Dila. Boris says, in the old country, five brothers shared one bed with two chickens and a goat, no less. Minka says, oy vey. To this day, he checks under the pillow for eggs. Where'd it go? Tommy says, my mommy said I didn't have to share my special toys with Dill, so I hided them. Chucky says, maybe hiding them wasn't such a good idea, Tommy. Tommy says, yeah, now I can't even share with myself. When is he going to start sharing with me? Chucky says, well, he gave you his sniffles, didn't he? Charlotte said, we have the most charming Little time share in Maui. Drew says, the one in Cancun's not too shabby either. Hey, Stu, you ever think about getting a timeshare? Stu says, what for? We've already got the best time sparer here. Stu says, just give it time, Deed. Before you know it, they'll be sharing like true brothers. Deedee says, you really think so? Stu said, Sure, they'll be giving each other knuckle sandwiches, sharing insults and splitting skulls. Dee Dee says, that's not funny, Stu. That's not funny. Sometimes sharing happens when you least expect it. When not sharing's worse than sharing. If you don't share those cookies with me, I'm gonna share this knuckle sandwich with you. How can I stop him from grabbing stuff? I don't know, Tommy, but I think we're stuck. Dee Dee says, you know, Betty, I'm wondering if I should buy the same toy for both Tommy and Dill. Betty said, don't be ridiculous, Dee. Sharing the toys will bring them closer together and help them learn teamwork and cooperation. Lil says, it's my reptar, Philip. Phil says, no, it's not, Lillian. Lil says, yes, it is, Philip. Phil says, no, it's not, Lillian. Sharing's easy. A, Phil, 
One sip for Dilly and two sips for me. Another sip for Dill and 11 sips for me. B, Lil, the most importantest thing is to me to, to find a good hiding place for your favorite stuff. You guys, don't hide your stuff in there. Don't hide your food in there. Oh, she's funny. C, Angelica says, Sharon's a piece of cake. Just share the toys you hate. What's that you don't like? Share those. <laughs> D, D, Chucky says, Sharon's easy when you're with the one who's being shared with. Charlotte says, I don't know how you do it, Dee Dee. I love my little darling, Angelica, so much. I just can't imagine dividing that love in two. Dee Dee says, oh, I don't divide my love, Charlotte. I multiply it. So now Angelica has her own rules for sharing. Let's read what they are. Angelica says, listen up, babies. I got some rules about sharing. If you drop it, it's mine. If you turn your back, it's mine. <laughs> if I give it to you, but change my mind, it's mine. If it tastes good, it's mine. If I want it, it's mine. Any questions? Minka says, what is this? Everywhere I look, I'm seeing double. Didi says, Oh, Ma, I can't help it. If I buy something for Tommy, I feel like I should get one for Dill. If I buy for Dill, I worry about Tommy. Minka says, nonsense. Do you want to spoil the ki kinder lash? Ah, I almost forgot. One for Tommy's kins and one for Bubba Dill and one for my little Dill Dida. Dill -di Dilla. What? I got them on special. Why do I have to share all the time? Chucky said, you don't got to share when he's sleeping. Tommy says, oh yeah, okay. Chucky says, gee, Tommy, Dill take away your ball. He take away your bottle and he take away your blankie. Tommy said, yeah. So how come he didn't take away my diapy rash? Sometimes you gotta share if you wanna get any sleep. Aw. I'm tired of sharing all my stuff with Dill. I wonder what it would be like around here without him. Then he thought about it. Lonely. Be lonely without him. Dee Dee said, Dr. Lipschitz says sharing will bring the two boys closer together. I'll let you wear it, Dill, but I gots to get out of it first. Chucky says, I never know sharing could be so dangerous. Stu says, I'm trying to keep it in front of the camera. Stu says, you got to be nice to your brother's sport and share with him. When your uncle Drew and I were kids, I always shared my, well, actually he took my Colonel Klondike's compass ring. And come to think of it, I don't remember Uncle Drew ever giving it back. Oh, snap. Excuse me, champ. I've got a phone call to make. Dee Dee said, oh, Stu, look. Tommy's sharing his teddy bear with Dill. Stu said, of course he is, Deed. He's a pickles. He comes from a long line of sharers. Drew said, hey, bro, can I borrow your weed whacker? Stu said, no way. It's brand new. I haven't even broken that baby in yet. Epilogue. Tommy says, hey, Chucky, you know why I always share my hugs with Dill? 
Chucky says, why, Tommy? Tommy says, because he always gives them back. How sweet is that? So I finished reading this story, the Rugrat story. Look at them fighting over this toy. I thought that was cute. They're twins. I finished reading my Nickelodeon's uh, Rugrat stories called Mine, A Grown-Up's Guide to Life with Little Ones and um, by Jill Gorey and Barbara Herndon. I picked that book for today because um, today's Thursday and today's supposed to be the inspirational day or quote day or whatever, um, whatever gets you guys thinking. And this was kind of something to get you guys thinking about. Helped you learn how to share and let you know that sharing is okay. It's okay to share. Even when you grow up, you got to share your things. You get married, you got to share things. So I hope you guys enjoyed this book. Please read the, um, the description in my, in my, uh, when I post this and thank you guys. And I'll see you again tomorrow at two o'clock, 2 PM. I got to shout out, got to shout out Emlyn and Quanisha, my niece and her son, Isaiah. All right, you guys. Thanks so much again for watching. See you tomorrow at 2 p.m.